Welcome back. Well, we've never liked traffic, right? But congestion is congestion in Houston is a good indicator. Things are going back to normal. More people going back to work and students returning to school. Though we're not 100% back to pre-pandemic traffic congestion, we're certainly getting close. Here's a look at the numbers. According to NREX and Houston Transstar data, your average speed in 2019 during peak travel times was just over 25 miles per hour. In 2020, your average peak hour speed was just under 40 miles per hour. When looking at your speed today in March, you're only driving about 5 miles per hour faster than you were in 2019. Clearly, the gap is closing. A good indicator traffic trends are getting closer to pre-pandemic times. According to Houston Transstar, drivers are feeling the heavier traffic patterns during the weekday evening peak hours. January and February of 2021, volumes were really close to the same time period back in 2020. There were nearly 19,000 cars on the road. In 2020, during the same time frame, which was pre-pandemic, Houston saw just about the same number of cars on the road during the evening rush hour commute. This goes to show that vehicle traffic is indeed returning. Enrix also helps us break down just how much time Houston drivers wasted in traffic. In 2020, Houston drivers wasted about 35 hours. Compare that number to 2019 when drivers wasted a whopping 81 hours in traffic. Even though that number was almost cut in half, today we are still ranked as one of the top 10 most congested cities in the U.S. It's worth noting, even though congestion is slowly making a comeback, a recent report says fewer Houstonians are driving into work. In 2019, nearly 85% of workers drove into the office compared to nearly 90% in 2010. Owen and Amy? Right. Yeah, it still feels still feels slower. It like does. In big commuting times, but we'll That's take what we can get. back to it.